is up you guys welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna to be filming a super requested video and I really hope you guys are excited about it because I am oh by the way hi I'm Danielle if you're new here subscribe join the Dan fam I post videos like every other day it's a good time today I'm going to be showing you guys what is on my iPhone 8 plus I don't have the iPhone 10 I don't really want it at least yet like I know eventually I'll have to upgrade and it'll be like that but there's just it looks like an Android like I'm sorry to you guys that have it like it's definitely probably really good and really cool the face scanner is awesome but I love my iPhone 8 and I'm really excited to show you guys what's on it I don't know if I have cool apps I straight up don't but this is the number one most requested video on my channel besides like morning routines and college week in my life so like it's time so what I'm gonna do is, as soon as I start, I'm gonna start the screen recording on my phone, and I'm just gonna put this, well, how about this? Boom. My phone screen, gonna be right there the whole time. I hope this works, I'm a little nervous, but hopefully it'll give you guys a good idea of what's on my phone. All right, I hope this works. Let's turn on screen recording. Ooh. All right, so we are in my phone now. Um, so as my background, I like to do a marble background just because I find it really simple. Like. I don't know, I don't wanna put pictures of me and my friends because then the apps just kinda of cover it, but that's just me. Um, so obviously I have all my most important and most, pretty much for the most part, most used apps, like, you know, subjective. Um, but I have Google Maps, it's my favorite way to use, especially like for walking directions, I find Google Maps to be really good and really accurate. I love Waze, it gives me the fastest um, routes to wherever I need to go. I use notes a lot, I love to read my horoscope. Um, I don't know, like I know it's like contra controversial, but um, I like to take bits and pieces of it, so it's just like fun sometimes. Un um is what I use to plan my pictures on Instagram. It's absolutely amazing. It's a free app, a little sneak peek, or maybe I've already posted these pictures, but I usually just like, so like this one, like the one with like the little Instagram symbol, means that's the last one I've posted. So then I like to like be like, okay, if I post this one next, like how will that look? Like whatever, I don't really know. It's really fun. I love it. Un is great. SoundCloud, Spotify, you guys know the gist. I love listening to music. YouTube, of course, group me because um, I'm in like a lot of like sorority like group me's or like on my dance team. Like there's just like, it's just a good way to like do group chats. Um, Snapchat, YouTube Studio, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. I'll shout out my Instagram super quick if you guys want to follow me. This is it. Uh, I always post fun Instagram stories. I love boomerangs. I absolutely love boomerangs. So just be be ready for the hat. Um, but yeah, you guys should follow me. On to the next page. We've got all kinds of things. I'm not gonna like go into each app, just the ones I find important. Starbucks, obviously, I like use that all the time. Um Facetune, I like to make white walls even whiter. I'll use the teeth whitening thing. Oh, dote. I love dote. You guys know I love dote actually. Um, so this is my dote profile. Let's see here. So on dote, it's basically an online shopping app, which is so cool. You can like shop so many stores and like add them to lists. So like I have like a Christmas wish list, a scene on my Instagram, like, and you guys can go follow me on there if you want. And you can also like shop my Instagram, like, they'll literally go on my Instagram and like add like the things I'm wearing. So that's always fun if you guys want to check that out. Um, I love iFunny. I think it's hilarious. Like, it's where the, they just post like a ton of memes, and like I just find it like really funny. But that's just me. I like look at that late at night, and it's really weird. I have a Truth or Dare app. It's really whatever. Uber. BuzzFeed, Wells Fargo, UGA app, it's basically where I can like see the bus schedule and all that stuff because I actually use the bus now. Um, oh, I have this like saved like to my home screen. I like count my subscribers because your girl is so close to 400,000. It's so crazy. Um, Pinterest, Facebook Messenger, heads up. It's like one of the best games ever. Oh, it's not like fully downloaded, but that's like the game where you're like, oh, so fun. Um, oops. Venmo is great. It's like when you can like pay your friends or whatever. Um, I literally, especially in college, it's like your friend will like get your, your meal for you. Okay, I'll Venmo you this. I'll Venmo you for like, like straight up. One time I Venmo my friend to go fill up my water bottle because I didn't want to get out of bed. Straight up. People do that. I'm not, it's just not just me. Um, I have Every Girl, which is not an app, I don't think. I think <coughs> I just saved it to like my page, but they just have like a ton of really great articles. Um, and I just really liked it. 
Um, UGA admission, oops, <laughs> UGA admissions, I guess I could delete that now. Um, guitar tabs, if you guys don't know, I play piano and basically guitar tabs has a ton of guitar tabs, but then they also, oh, I have the free version clearly, have um, a ton of like chords that you can play like on the piano and it just like, it's so fun. Like when I just want to sit down and like just jam out, you know, just have a good jam stash. I hate myself. Um, Vine camera, I don't know what that is, but Vine doesn't really exist anymore, so... <laughs> Um, house party's really fun. I don't even think any of my friends have it. Oh, I'm like not logged in since I got a new phone. But <laughs> house party's really funny. It's like FaceTiming like 10,000 people at once. Not 10,000. Like me and like six of my friends house party. It's like a ton of FaceTimes. It's actually really fun. Like if I go on the app and I'm like logged in and it'll be like Danielle's on and then someone will join. It's really funny. Honestly, I need to bring that back. Um, I have Amazon Alexa app. Oh, I just said her name. She might have heard me. Oh, I think we're in the clear. I think we're in the clear. Um, Park Mobile, it's like this place, this place. It's an app where like some um, parking lots use this app where you can like pay on there. So that's why I have it. Um, oh my gosh, I have so many old apps. I literally have Into the Woods rehearsal schedule saved on here from like my musical in high school. So many random things. Flickster to check movie times. Photo prints, that's CVS or Walgreens. We got Walgreens, photo prints. When like I like want some photos printed, you could just <coughs> upload them to the app. Here, Kira is really cool. This is like if you see on Instagram people's like, well here I'll, I'll do it. If you see people's like how like they get sparkles, they just like film it on that app. Like I did that. It makes like your just things everything look so cool. And I actually bought that I think. Um, on to the next page. We have um. Wow, this is just so Getty Images. Cause one time I went to Beauty Gone, and like they, this guy from Getty Images took a picture of me, and I was like, wait, let me see. Um, I have Time Hop. Let's see what's on my Time Hop today. Time Hop's basically, if you guys don't know, it like shows you your photos from like a year ago today, two years ago today, or like anything you tweeted. Oh, this picture. Oh my God, that's I can't believe that's already a year ago. It was so cold one side, one day outside in high school, and like Caitlin and I just laid down. It's like tweets. Oh my God, this was our last day. Or, I don't know, happy, oh, it was our director's birthday. Um, aw. Oh, here's me dancing. I guess I went to dance class a year ago today. Fun stuff, fun stuff either way. Um, I have my Soho Cycle spin place schedule saved at Ticketmaster. Countdown, when I want to make countdowns, train of things. Um, I have Zemi, which is something I used for college apps back in the day. Edline was, um, Edline was something I used in high school. Clearly, I haven't cleared this out. The Forever 21 app, because you can shop on Forever 21 on your phone, and you know I love Forever 21. Revolve, super into Revolve these days. Super cute stuff, so I like to look at what they've got going on there. Um, receipts, StubHub, Airbnb. Shazam, use this all the time when I'm like somewhere and I'm like, what's this song? I know you can like ask Siri, but I never have luck with it, so I still go on Shazam. Okay, next page, let's see. Um, I've got a QR code reader, Papa John's app, very, very essential. We order lots of Papa John's here at UGA. Um, I have pre-flight parking, which is how I, if I do decide to drive to the airport, if I'm just doing like a weekend trip, um, it's like super cheap airport parking, so I have that app. European Wax Center, that's where I get my eyebrows done, so you can book appointments on there. I have Postmates, of course. I have this like radar app because my dad's super obsessed with radar. Like, dad, if you're watching this, don't worry, I use it sometimes. But looks like there's no rain coming my way. We are good to go, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Netflix. I don't really know what Let's Talk is. Oh, I forgot I had this app, guys. This is actually really cool. So, like, you know sometimes you're at a table and you and your friends are like, what should we talk about? Or, like, like you, there's just no one talking. So there's this thing called Let's Talk. I forgot I had this. And it's, like, gives you things to, like, talk about. Like, what is the best book you've ever read? Or, like, I don't know. Me and my friends did it one time, and it was actually, like, it made some good conversation. Next page. Let's see what we got going on here. I don't know half the stuff. Oh, I've got a lot of, like, airlines. Delta, Southwest. Um, American Airlines. So I traveled a lot this year, or last year, I guess now. It's 2018 now. Um, and I just like having an app. <coughs> Bulldog Foods, like a way to order food. Um, in Athens, it's like created for like UGA students. Um, Pocket Camp, really disappointed in it. It's like the Animal Crossing app version, and like I'm just not happy about it. 
I literally went home during winter break and played on my DS because I just like missed Animal Crossing so much. I re-downloaded Trivia Crack because my roommate was like, play with me, and it's actually fun. I just can't keep up with it. It's like where you do like trivia games and like you play against a person online. Um, oh, I just got this app called Calm. Take a deep breath. And you can like, I haven't really started it yet. Um, but you like choose your top goals and like, I think it's like a meditation app. Um, Pixar, if you guys are wondering how I do those cool stickers on some of my photos, I use this app um, and you basically, there's like all these really cool stickers. Like I do stars a lot um, and it's really cool. I think this A plus grades is like a way to calculate like your GPA or something. I don't know, I downloaded it once because my friends told me to get it and I never did anything with it. Um, oh, I have this 3D effect app that I just got. It's really cool. It can make pictures look like 3D and like cool and artsy, you know? Um, I got Rad VHS, which I'm pretty sure it makes your videos look like they are old, um, VCR videos or whatever. <coughs> I have Life360 because my dad told me to download it, but we still haven't done anything about it. It's like a way to like track your kids, <laughs> lol. <coughs> um, yeah, it's really kind of all on this page. And lastly, um, oh, I got that arts and culture app or whatever. I haven't done it yet, but it's where you can see like if your face looks like a painting, but I couldn't figure it out. So I just haven't done anything with it. I really need to clear out my apps is what this video is really teaching me. Lastly, this is one of my new favorite apps. It's called Unfold and it makes your Instagram look stories look so dope. So like, well, let's make one. Um, this will be called today. Um, you guys have probably seen these before, but it's a free app. This guy created it. It's one of my friend's friends. Um, and it's just really cool ways to like put cool layouts on your Instagram story. So let's say I want to post a few more. Let's say like I post a picture on Instagram, but I have a few more photos from that that I want to show. So like why I'll do like this one in one and then and then I'll do another here and I could just be like today and like make it really cool. Um, and like some you can add text to it and you can say if you want to save it as a story or like a page. So I'm saving it as an Instagram story and it just makes your Instagram look story look so clean. Like if you have inquiries and stuff, inquiries, inquiries. Um, so let's see if it works. If I don't even know if it's saved. Uh, oh, this, go Griffin. Uh, so yeah, and then you can like post it to your Instagram story and be like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's just fun. It's just fun, regardless. Um, but yeah, I'll stop this screen recording now. I hope you guys enjoyed looking into my phone and being really creepy. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I filmed the video. It's okay. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Like, I literally just filmed this because you guys wanted to see it. So I hope you got something out of it. Comment down below your favorite app. Or comment down below, like, your favorite productivity app or health app. Just something, like, useful in my life. Because I don't need any more games. I don't need games because I'll just play them the whole time. That's literally why I don't really have many games on my phone. Um, but yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.